<laughs> hey everybody, it's Adam Richmond here. I got the essentials, which is Paddington. <laughs> Pad, say hello to the world. Hey, you can see he's very excited to be in my arms. All right, everybody, welcome to Comedy Quarantine. This is day six, and I'm super excited that my dog was dropped off coronavirus free, you know, which is awesome. He's here with me because I've been out, what, six days now? And looks like the world is catching up to me, everybody. It looks like uh, it's going on out there where uh, they've canceled sports leagues, Broadway, uh, movie theaters, the NHL. This is the worst time to be quarantined, guys. W what do we do? We're quarantining ourselves when there's no professional sports on. <laughs> How boring. We're going to just reruns of just crap, except Golden Girls. That's... Best show. So, uh, welcome to the show, everybody. I'm excited to uh, to be alive. Um, I didn't go out. I heard that uh, there was lineups out the door, Trader Joe's and at Ralph's, and uh, that's not good news. But fortunately, my local 7-Eleven delivers, and I got all the essentials, including bread and peanut butter, and of course jam. So I'll be able to survive for a certain amount of time on the important things. Uh, you know, I'm, uh, I'm alive and well, and uh, fortunately there's some uh, crazy shit going on out there. But don't worry, guys. I'm here to entertain you while you're stuck, sequestered inside. And tonight we're going to party like it's COVID-1999. Oh, that's, that's some good stuff right there. Best was an audience, with an audience, but uh, of course that's not happening here as I'm sequestered indoors. Um, but everyone's crazy. I will say that the, the fear of the virus is far worse than the virus it's, itself. Just like that expression, we have nothing to fear but fear itself, but that's what's going on there. So guys, just tone it down a little bit. Sure, grab some food. Don't grab it all. But these lineups of Trader Joe's and crap like that, it's just... Uh, it's always fear that people have of things that don't happen. They worry about stuff that might happen. Like, do you know how many people complained to Sesame Street about Cookie Monster singing about cookies and that their kids were getting fat as a result of that. <laughs> Do you know that? So now Cookie Monster has to sing about vegetables. <laughs> I know! How fucking sad is that? What's that song gonna be? C is for carrot. That's good enough for me. Fuck you, Cookie Monster. I'm gonna kick you in your blue balls. Plus, if you think your kids are getting fat because of Cookie Monster, if you really pay attention, he doesn't even have a throat. He's just smashing cookies against his face, face leaving a trail of cookie crumbs in his wake. And this one is Sesame Street so politically correct, guys. They've got a toy called Tickle Me Elmo. That's already pretty perverted. I mean, Tickle Me Elmo? Now there's specific toys like, uh, I got my new toy, it's a Sodomize Me Rick. He's talking about like a figure in my ass, Snuffleupagus. He's talking to a strictly platonic Bert and Ernie. People are crazy, and that's what we have to worry about the most. Do you know that somebody came after Kermit the Frog on the Muppet Show? Because Kermit doesn't wear pants. <laughs> You know who else doesn't wear pants? Actual frogs! What do you have to do? Run through the jungle? Like, putting uh, trousers on lions now? Like, come here, king of the jungle! His lion balls swing like... Arr, 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 arr. I have real fears, you know? Like, real fears. Like, uh, terrorism. I'm scared of terrorists. Not really ISIS, though. I don't think ISIS is so scared. If you look at ISIS like a frozen, delicious treat you bought at 7-Eleven. Hey, what do you mean? It's my new raspberry lemonade flavored ISIS. Fighting terrorism one lick at a time. That's what I want to know about ISIS, though. That's what I want to know. How come every time you hear something terrible going on in the world, you always hear that ISIS claims responsibility, right? Like, how do they go about doing that? Is there, like, one guy that gets to work the ISIS hotline and call in all the good tips? Hello, this is ISIS. You know the bombing on the bridge in Paris on Wednesday? That was ISIS! Do you remember the car drove into a bunch of people on a bridge in London on Thursday? That too was ISIS! Remember when your bike was stolen when you were 12 years old? Well, that wasn't ISIS, but we laughed a lot because we were very upset. Anyhow, this is ISIS. And <laughs> what are they called to claim responsibility, but somebody already claimed it for them? How upset would they be? They called, like, hello, this is ISIS. Can you hold, please? Yes, okay. And then put out some, like, uh, some music, like Neil Diamond, like Cracklin' Rosie, get on board. We're gonna ride to the end. Hello? Hello, this is ISIS. Yes, can you, can you spell that, please? Yes, it's I-S-I-S. -S. So is, is it fucking ISIS? Anyhow, we'd like to claim responsibility for the bombing of the uh, church in Iraq on Saturday. Well, actually, it says right here that was Al-Qaeda. Fucking Al-Qaeda! Every single fucking time! Okay, 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 okay. Uh, we also, uh, we killed a 
Ebony Man in Turkey on Friday. It doesn't say anything about uh, that. Uh, okay, okay. Refresh your page. Scroll down. Yes, underneath the story of the Kardashians having twins. That was ISIS! The truth is, guys, I just like doing the terrorist voice. You know, so much so that my whole act has evolved into the all-terrorist karaoke channel. You know, she was a fast machine. She kept my motor clean. She was the best damn woman that I ever seen. Don't go changing to try and please me. I love you just the way you are in pieces. And then I saw her face. But that was illegal. You know, because the veil. The, the veil. Then I met her in a hut down in Old Kabul. Well, she smelled like curdy and it made me drool. Her name was Ach Mach. Ach, 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 mach. Ach, 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 ach. I'm not dumb, but I can't understand why she walks like a camel, talks like Saddam. Oh my, ach, bah. And finally, start spreading the news. We're killing the Jews. We're going to be a part of it. Jihad, jihad. If you can blow up there, you'll blow up anywhere. It's up to you. Jihad. Had and then I just blow up. That's the only way to end that set, you know? And believe me, I can make fun of that stuff also because I'm the Jew that made fun of blowing up Jews. Okay, can we be clear about that? But <laughs> it's just comedy, guys. And stay put and enjoy it from inside. Safety. Disease free, guys. I love you all. Subscribe, enjoy, and I'll see you tomorrow, hopefully, if I survive. <sighs> Goodbye.